March 19, 2015, marks death of John Tu, a criminal who was accused in 15 cases. His body was recovered from rail tracks in Joshua. But eight years down the line, the death of John Tu has been exploited by BNP leaders to frame Awami League leaders as murderers. Empowered by recent power structure, local BNP activists brought a plaintiff who disregarded facts and churned out an outright false story, centering the death. 38 Awami League activists altogether hacked Jontu. After police allowed this new unverified allegation as part of a nexus with BNP leaders, now Awami League leaders are asked to pay money for dropping the charges the unholy scheme to use the legal system to mint out money from Awami League leaders also fell flat in light of media reports on death of John Tu. A local newspaper, Grammar Barta, dated March 20th, clearly exposed the location of body recovery. Like these ill-fated 38 Awami League activists in Jokur, thousands of party leaders are falling prey to this newly emerged unlawful scheme of false murder charges in addition to killing spree, looting, and arson since August 5th, and there is complete silence from those tasked to ensure rule of law.